Starting with Leo. Yeah. Because, you know, she's your favourite Sturgeon, isn't she? <laughs> well, she's not, <laughs> she's not, not little friend. We may share an accent, but that's about as far as it goes. <laughs> uh, no, it's, it's disgusting. And, and what she's doing, mm. what we're seeing in, in Scotland with this really visceral, sort of bitter mm. uh, mob shouting abuse, even assaulting people. You know, mm. Holly Mosscrop was, was assaulted. She had her clothes grabbed. Mm -hmm. And not in a fun Beatlemania way. This is this is in an aggressive, nasty way. Uh, what we're seeing is, is the outcome of, of all nationalist movements. I mean, if you look at uh, Hitler's Nazi party or, or the BNP, uh, they all dehumanise the opposition mm. and they, they foment this, uh, this visceral hatred and, and legitimise this, this mob rule and this rage. It's disgusting to see it in Scotland. Well, it is a bit of a disappointment as well, because I thought we had rules against hate speech, so I thought that that would actually almost be seen as illegal. I mean, they were saying things like scum and then there were other words which are unrepeatable on TV, you know, frankly. I mean, Lizzie... Well, I've always thought she's an irritant. I agree with Liz Trust, she's an attention seeker. Mm. But you know what? Most of all, she's irresponsible and dangerous because, she, as you said, she's inciting, you know, yeah. anger and she's feeding the mob's growing rage. She's feeding it. Mm. And, and don't forget, we've had two British MPs that have been murdered. Mm. And, you know, it just takes one person, this fanatical, that's what they are, to do something like that. And she needs to stand up. She, As a leader, any leader should stand up and absolutely be against this sort of behaviour.